Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Project Slammy, and in this episode we are going to fight Blaine. But first, let's switch in Naked, because Naked hasn't really been able to take out anyone. So yeah, let's just do this. Yeah, his gym and Cinnabar burned down, and somehow he managed to get on this island even though none of his Pokemon can use Surf. I don't know, well, well, let's see, does he have any Pokemon that can learn Fly, maybe? I don't think so. He just has a Rapidash, a Ninetales, a, um, a Marcargo, I think a Hondoom, and something else. Oh, an Arcanine, of course. Oh, wait, no, he just has Rapidash, Ninetales, and... Oh, no, he does have a Magcargo. Okay. I wonder if he had one of them. Okay, I'm not even gonna bother Thunder Waving, but I am going to Thunder Punch. Hopefully, come on, knock it out. Ah, uh, almost. Ooh, this is gonna hurt. Honestly, Macargo would be a better Pokemon if it wasn't so fucking slow. I mean, if you hit it with, I mean, if you hit it with ground and water, it's pretty much dead. So that's just another thing that sucks about it. Like. No, I just wish it was better. Oh, he has a Magmar in this game. Why do I remember him having, like, an Arcanine and shit? Oh, wait, fuck that. I'm not switching. What the fuck? What the hell is that? Okay, let's, uh, let's Thunder Wave it. Get it paralyzed. Hopefully, stay paralyzed. Oh, and you decided to be a dick. Okay. Okay. Let's see, light screen. Would that even hurt me? No. I wonder, if if it backfired on me, would it actually hurt? Let's see, I'm confused. Okay, come on. God, this is gonna be like a weird episode. He only has three Pokemon. Maybe I'll just head over to Blue's gym and fight him too. And then we'll be on like this awkward awkward place. Because I decided like, um, I might be able to do the the rune puzzles. I don't know. Over in Johto. Like, I have some stuff I want to show off, but I don't want to show off, like, too much. Because I don't, honestly, I never get Tyro in my, uh, or however the fuck he's pronounced. I never get him in my original playthrough. I, I honestly, I don't. I don't know why. I just don't. And, uh, yeah. Okay, so he's sending out Rapid Edge. Okay, let's, uh, switch. Send out... God damn it, Sandy. You haven't... You haven't done anything recently. I think the last time I used Sandy was when I knocked out that one thing on, uh... On the biker's path. And it's, so, you know what? I'll let you get the kill. Okay, because I I haven't really let him do anything. Not too much. See, I'm trying not to make it too easy for me. See, that's the that's the thing. Like, it, it's getting too easy at this point in the game. See, I don't have a lot to do left. I have one more gym left, and then it's my final opponent. And I'm not gonna spoil who that is, but it's pretty fucking epic. Who it is. Um, yeah. Yeah, it burned all of his hair off, too. All of his bad jokes that he'd written. Who the hell is that guy? That guy was not in the gym beforehand. Who the fuck is that guy? Yeah, he's gonna rebuild his Cinnabar gym, and he's gonna have a rematch. But guess what? You're never gonna get the... Re Yo, huh? It's over already? Oh, okay. Sorry, dude. So I didn't know where to find you. Dude, maybe- Oh my god, are you Wilton? Wilton, did you lose weight? No. Okay, no, no Wilton. No Wilton today. It's only four- You know what? Okay, let's do it. Sandy, I'm gonna let you- now this is gonna be a cool fight. Here, who should we start off with? Uh, 
think he starts off with Pidgeot, so I'm going to send out Naked first. Why not? Okay, come on. Honestly, my team worked out really well. It was very well balanced throughout the Let's Play, I felt. So, honestly, this, this battle's a piece of cake. He's honestly, he's not that hard. Really isn't. So, let's, uh, let's go fight him. He has no cronies. It's just straight up battle. Let's do it. This is my final badge that I have to get. I have beaten everyone. Now I just have to battle the former Kanto Pokemon League champion. Which, technically, if I beat Red, then I'm the champion champion. I don't know. The hierarchy shit that they have going on in the Pokemon world is really strange. They should just have, like, Johto League champion, Kanto, you know. And then I think they actually do have that, but they don't emphasize it in the games. So it's kind of like, because Red disappeared, am I truly the champion? Because technically I have to beat him. He's not, he, but then again, he, he's not a defending champion. He hasn't defended his championship. Presumably, he's been up at fucking uh, Mount Everest. I, I mean, Mount Silver. For God knows how long. Okay. He's probably going to use a hyper... No, he didn't. Use quick attack. Okay, that was actually very smart. God, Pidgeot is so cool. He just is. I don't even know what else to say. Okay. Alright, he's sending out Rhydon. Let's send out... I'm gonna be a little better in these fights. Let's send out... S struggle. I like Struggle. Struggle has actually come to be my favorite member of my team. <laughs> he used to be my least favorite. Obsidian used to be my favorite. And poor Sandy, one of those. They used to be like my babies, but now Struggle's my baby. Because he's just, he's proven himself. He really has. He, he hit a certain stride at some point. I don't know when or where it happened. But he's just been remarkable. For the past, like, 20 some odd episodes. And I mean... Aganium's a good Pokemon, I, I just, I don't know. Mine was, like, dumb. I thought mine was mentally retarded or something. Because <laughs> so, he just, if you guys remember, he didn't hit anything. I mean, God damn, didn't hit anything. Okay, I don't think I can put it to sleep. Oh, oh, I can. That's good. Okay, because I kind of want everyone to get their two cents in this battle. Oh, that's not fair. Don't wake him up. Is that even gonna do anything? Is that gonna do much? I can't remember how powerful that is. Oh, okay, well that's decent, I guess. Should be doing a lot more for level 58 Executor. I mean, that's kind of like a signature move you have there. Oh man, I'm so tired. It's 1.10 in the morning. I've been up since 5.30 yesterday. And after this, I'm just gonna fucking go to bed. I mean, and this is a good note to go to bed on. Defeating two gym leaders? I mean, come on. It can't get any better than that. Resting easy. And then I got some other stuff to do before I, I get to my, uh my challenger. Oh shit, did I, did I spoil who it was? Okay, you guys all know who it is. It's red. God, I am so bad at keeping secret. I remember, speaking of obsidian, now that I'm sending him out, with obsidian, I actually spoiled who I was going to pick when I was teasing, I was giving hints at the end of the video. Which Eevee evolution I was going to pick. And I was like, oh, well, you know, it's going to take a while because I got to train to happiness, but you guys don't know if I'm going to use a Thunderstone or how to... It's like, you 
dumbass? Why would anyone think otherwise? You know? That you were going to... Like, I don't, I don't know. I was so dumb. I was so... I am so dumb when it comes to surprises. Is he just going to keep using recovery? Yeah, he's going to be that guy. Come on. You're going to die anyway. I know. I feel bad. I feel kind of bad. I kind of didn't want to send up City now because his... Oh, okay, Sam literally can't do shit, so... You know, if I just confuse him, it's going to be hell using the cover. Right? I mean, won't it actually hurt him if he uses... I'm getting really annoyed <laughs> with his shit now. Now I don't feel bad, because he's just being a dick now. Yeah, it does hurt him. Okay, good. That was a good remedy for that situation. Whenever you have that dick that's, like, trying to spam a move like that, just hit him with a confuse ray or an attract or something, and they get so mad. Oh, my God. I mean, it doesn't fix the problem entirely because you can't really fix someone else being a douchebag other than, you know, smacking him or something. But in this case, just hit him with a... A thunder wave or a confused ray, and oh my god, they get so angry. And this thing's gonna die. This this thing's gonna go down like three seconds, unfortunately. Gyarados is a very good Pokemon, but he doesn't stand a chance against an electric type Pokemon. Even if it's a shitty electric type Pokemon, he just goes down like that. No matter how high of a level he is. Because he's got that quad weakness to, uh, to electric, and holy shit. Hey, wait a minute. Where's your fucking Eevee and your... Am I just too stupid to remember you didn't have one? Okay. Let's see. S did Squidward do any... Yeah, Squidward did stuff. Okay. Now it's the final. I've used every single one of my Pokemon in this fight, except for Sandy. Sandy, you are my baby. Don't fail me. Earthquake. Come on, Sandy. You can do this. Come on, Sandy. Sandy, no. There we go. There she is. Are you fucking kidding me? Uh-oh. What a, what a dumbass. He uses brain dance when he has a fucking... Why do they always do that? They've clearly seen electric-type Pokemon. Gyarados is faster than Aphros. So if I was in that position, I'd at least set off, like, a Hyper Beam. Something to do some huge damage. Because I, I know that that... Or even something that if I had... If I harbored anything, a move, that could possibly knock it out in one hit. I would do that. Because... I know, no matter how good your Gyarados is, it is not gonna fuck- Don't nobody fucking believe that a Gyarados is gonna withstand a fucking Thunder Punch from an Ampharos. No way in hell. So yeah, I get the Earth Badge from Blue. He actually put up quite a fight. I mean, he was- he did actually pretty well. I mean, he- he follows suit to his names I gave him, Asshole and Douche, so I'll give him that. So yeah, he's pretty good. Don't you forget it. Okay. Cool, I like that. Short and sweet. He didn't ramble on and on. His whole gym is created of Legos. And guys, I think that calls it for this episode and this recording session. Because I am dead ass tired. This is my seventh episode in a row recording. And oh my god, I am so sleepy. Was oh, and the Rebels effect wore off. Perfect timing. Like, I wouldn't be able to sleep at night if my Raquel- Uh, ugh, My Raquel. My Raquel wasn't on. And why am I going in here? I wanted to show the time. Oh, wait. That is how I show time. See? Oh, well, it's an hour past. But it's actually 1.19 in the morning. But So, yeah, guys. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go for now. And uh, next time, Pokemon Silver.
We're gonna go fight my opponent. Maybe. I don't know. There's a couple other things we gotta do. Not in Kanto. In Johto. So I'll see you guys later. Have a good day. And make sure you get some sleep because it's very healthy for you. Don't, don't take by my example whatsoever. Bye guys!